Hey guys, Jason John 2 here, and I've got some interesting info for you guys on several different topics. But we're going to start with a space map. So, since my last video on it, it has gotten a substantial update, as you can probably see in the footage now. It actually is okay, in my opinion, now. I mean, it still doesn't exactly fit 100% with the theme, but, I mean... From what I understand, it's going to be a one-week event or something along those lines, so if it's not a permanent feature in the game, I think I'm okay with it, so... And especially with this update, now you can actually go onto like the surface of the moon or something, because the base now opens up onto the surface of the moon, which is something I did not expect, and... Well, I think it greatly improves the gameplay, because first off, snipers are usable. I actually got quite a few... Pretty nice quick scopes up there, and I was surprised by it, but... Uh, lower RPM guns, such as the Scar-L, are also usable, as I have footage of doing that. So, jumping around with a shotgun is not the only strategy anymore. And... Normal strategies that work on other maps also work on this one now. It's just, like, say you wanted to... Stay behind cover and snipe a little bit. That actually works if you stay off far enough. You just have to aim below your opponent rather than above them. Just wait till they hit the peak of their jump and then aim below them and shoot. It's pretty simple, actually, once you get the hang of it. In addition to this, uh, points are placed much better, so of course it isn't just shotguns jumping around the points. There actually are some out in the open, and of course the hill is actually accessible now, and it isn't just the bottom of a pit, which is, of course, much better than before. But one thing that makes me think that this is going to be added soon is the fact that there are now badges on the main game of Phantom Forces that are themed around the space map. This likely means it'll be added in a in the update or in an event coming very, very soon, which I'll get to later. But the badges are win three rounds on the space map and find the, the codex in a hidden room. Now, if win three rounds is pretty self-explanatory, I mean, sure. But the Codex thing, i not sure what to expect with this, or is it something we pick up in the room, or what? I don't know where they could be hiding a room, and I doubt it was actually in the test place. But I guess we'll see. If any of you find it when the update comes out, and you find it before me, then send me a message on Discord or something about it so that I can make a video on it, because I'd like to help you guys get batches, so that's cool. Also, there's another new map, the Docks map revamped. So, some of you may remember a while back, I did a video on a map in the test place. I think it was actually the first instance of me playing on the test place ever, but... It was the docks map that Ace Gear Studios was making. And that never ended up going anywhere. Well, it's back, only a revamped. So, it's much smaller than before, much more close quarters oriented, which will probably appease you guys who really wanted the close quarters map and wanted the space map to be it. But, of course, snipers are still pretty viable on it, where you can you can snipe from on top of the cargo ship, you can snipe from on top of the crane. I didn't actually play the map for very long, because I didn't get much of a chance to. The, the test play shut down before I could play very much, but... There's several buildings around there that, was very, that were very, very good for sniping, and I personally liked it, even though I didn't get a very, very good idea of it, but hey. I'm not exactly sure when it's coming, but it looks like it's pretty well done. I mean... There are some update pictures on the subword a while back, but I, don't know, I, I was impressed by it, so I guess we'll find out when it comes out. So Maybe it'll be an update too? I don't know. Well, yeah, speaking of that, rumor is that it is coming the 8th of December. In other words, if you're watching this the day it goes up, it'll be tomorrow. And the only evidence we have for this that I'm aware of is the fact that Axis actually, like, sent someone a message on Discord about it. I don't know if it was as a joke, or what was it, or... I don't know, but it's possible. And there's little bits of evidence coming in from out it, like... How a test play shuts down, like, they don't need to test too much anymore, like, it's almost ready. And then how they add the badges, and then how they have the notice in the description that says... The game will be closing temporarily over the next week for internal testing to prepare for a significant update. Be prepared that the game may suddenly shut down on you when you're playing. So, it actually may be legit, so... Why not go check the place tomorrow? I don't know. <clears throat> for all I know, the game could be shut down and the update being added right now while you're watching this. But, hey, I guess we'll see. 
Yeah, anyways, I'm going to leave you guys to watch the footage. I hope you enjoy, and let me know what you think in the comments. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.